So there's a really great activity that you can work on when you're trying to be mindful. It's called RAIN, R-A-I-N. It's a four step tool that hopefully you can easily remember. By practicing this RAIN technique, you can really identify how are you even feeling? And that will help you walk through some of these difficult emotions that are arising from your separation and divorce. So for the R, we wanna recognize, how are you feeling? Start by asking yourself, how do I feel right now? Are you anxious? Are you sad? Are you numb? Are you relieved? Are you happy? A, allow. Allow that feeling to be there. No matter what the feeling is, allow it to take place. Don't try to ignore it. Don't try to bury it. Accept that feeling because otherwise it's more likely to continue. Don't bury it. Don't allow the feeling of being sad just resonate with you. I investigate. Why are you having this feeling? Become aware of the feeling. What is happening before you started to feel this way? What made you happy? What made you sad? What made you angry? Was it by saying goodbye to your children? Is it an easy email from an ex that has really triggered an angry emotion. N, nurture. Nurture without judgment. Remember, feelings are not permanent. You will change how you're feeling. It won't help if you just keep thinking about the emotion or judge yourself for feeling that way. It's a completely separate issue. We want to acknowledge that you're feeling this way because if we can't acknowledge the feeling, we can't work through it. So again, recognize the feeling, allow the feeling, figure out why by investigating the feeling and then really nurture without judgment. It's okay to feel the way you feel. 